Hispanic Heritage Month here at KPIX 5 with our special Una Familia coverage. And today we're highlighting Peruvian culture and how food is so ingrained in its history. Joining me now in the studio is Tapita and Ulises from Inca's Grill Peruvian Restaurant and Bar in Concord. Welcome. Hello. Good Thank morning. you for joining us. I want to start with you, Tapita. You know, can you tell us a little bit about your roots and where you're from and then how do you stay connected to that? Yes, um, my name is Tabitha. Good morning, everyone. We're um, coming from Inca's Grill in Concord, California. Um, I am Peruvian. My uncle is Peruvian. We come from a big Peruvian family. My mom and dad are both Peruvian. So the culture is very strong. Uh, Peru is known for a lot of great things. Obviously, their food, uh, Cusco, Machu Picchu, they're very nice culture. Uh, our, on our flag is a llama. We are very rooted in Peru, so a lot of things uh, that we like to do, you know, involve a culture, big family things, you know. So it's and nice. it's so important to recognize that culture right here in the Bay Area. Yes. Ulises, I want you to talk to me about how did this idea of opening up this restaurant come about? Because I heard you started as a truck driver and it just kind of went from there. Yeah, we you know, we, my wife family, they opened it, they have a teacher business mm -hmm. in Fitchman Wharf. So we started in the Fitchman Wharf and a connection with the Alioros and we started from Afghanistan. So it was interesting on you know, the tourists, you know, the San Francisco and the seafood. So I have working for almost five years mm -hmm. in, um, in, um, in the Kravistan and I live in Concord. So that thing was, you know, um, I opened a restaurant business for the culture, you know, open the Peruvian food. Mm. What we make is all traditional, we there for the scratch, and um, well, we there for almost 13 years, so. And it smells so good, it looks so good. I want you all to kind of walk me through what we have before us because this food looks so delicious. Yes. By the way, the morning show, we love food. Yeah. <laughs> we do too. So Don't what do worry. we have here? Yeah, so here we have, starting off with our very famous traditional appetizer. This is a causa de pollo. Okay. Chicken. Causa, it's chicken. We, it originated in Peru. Actually, it comes from like a Colombian Peruvian uh, like aspect, but it's very good. It's served cold. I know a lot of people think mashed potato, they think warm, mm -hmm. <laughs> but it's definitely very good, very tasty. It's seasoned with lime, a lot of Peruvian seasonings. It has stuffed with avocado, vegetables, very good. Our second dish right here is a lomo saltado. Okay. This is very traditional. In Peru, um, we don't eat no tortillas, so I know it's really odd, mm -hmm. but we have a, we come from a lot of white rice and a lot of potatoes. There's over 500 different potatoes in Peru. So in this dish, we incorporate steak, tomatoes, onions, a lot of cilantro. Are those fries underneath Yes, there? it comes <laughs> with French fries yeah. on, underneath, okay. uh -huh. very juicy, and then it comes with white rice, so a lot of carbs, but very delicious. Okay. Yes, and then our third dish over here is a very traditional Traditional. Everyone loves it. A ceviche de pescado. It's uh, very fresh. We make it instant. You have to order it, and once you order it, we make it right away. Uh, fresh lime. We have Peruvian uh, choclo, which is the corn. Mm -hmm. We have crunchy corn over here, which is like a basic, like a corn nuts, mm -hmm. and then we serve it with sweet potato, and that's how we eat it. It, it looks, looks so delicious. Look the drink, the oh, chicha. Oh yes, and then we have here, the this is a chicha morada. Oh. It's very a, good, very it's good. homemade. We make it homemade every day at Inca's Grill. It comes from a purple corn, and they okay. boil it. As soon as they boil it, they put pineapple, uh, cinnamon, a little bit of, uh, you know, like let that boil for a long time, and then they strain it and put sounds lime good. and sugar. All it's right, sounds good. We'll be right back. We're going to try some of this. Yes. 